I really like the HBO show, The Climb. It's a good show, uh, competition climbers, uh, with Chris Sharma, Jason Molna. It's good. I mean, it's, it's, it's a fun show, but there's a problem. There are three types of belays when you're in multi-pitch climbing. Uh, there are direct belays, indirect belays, and redirect belays. Okay, a direct belay is a belay where you're belaying directly off the anchor. You've put your device on the anchor, a gree gree or an auto-blocking device, and you're belaying the climbers that come up to the anchor. An indirect belay is where you clip yourself into the anchor and you're belaying off of your body. Uh, sometimes we do this if the anchor isn't that good. It's more of an alpine climbing technique in this era. And then there's the redirected belay. The redirected belay is where you belay off your body, the rope goes up through the anchor and goes down to the climber. This is an older school technique. Uh, it's the way I learned in the 90s, but it's gone away as people have become more commonly used to direct belays. Direct belays are great because it's only the force of the climber on the anchor. Uh, that climber's force goes directly into the anchor. You're not part of the system. Indirect blaze, of course, you're part of the system. And redirected blaze, you're part of the system. Uh, in a redirected belay, you actually put twice the force on the anchor. You put the force of the climber and the force of the belayer into the anchor, which could be a problem if it's a poor anchor. Uh, you also could get pulled into the anchor, and that's where there's a problem in the climb. In one episode, they elect to do a multi-pitch climb and they use a redirect. This isn't the easiest to see because it's a photo from my computer. I couldn't screenshot HBO. Um, but what you can see here is that she's using a gree gree. It's redirected through the anchor and goes down to the climber. Danger. The problem with this redirect is that uh, the person could get pulled up into the anchor and look at what kind of device she's using. She's using a gree gree. So the result is that if she gets pulled into the anchor by a heavier partner or by a poor stance, the gree gree will be defeated and the partner will fall. It's understandable why they did this. They're in a race, they're trying to go fast. And one of the adv advantages of a redirected belay is that uh, when you're swapping leads, a person can just rip right past you and keep going. Um, but it is not a best practice. And indeed, if you were to do this as a guide in a guide exam, you would get a no pass for that technique.